Louisiana is expected to pass bills controlling pronoun usage and discussions of gender and sexuality in the classroom, which opponents call don't say gay bills. A lot of people believe the, the pronouns, as people are calling them, are, are mislabeling uh, gender. So a lot of people don't want to do that because they believe, hey, why should I tell someone and call somebody about something I don't believe they are? Similar laws are being passed around the country, and high school students in New Orleans say the laws will harm their mental health. The fact that people are spending so much time to control our bodies and to try to take away aspects of our, our identities that not even we can control um, is really hard to grasp at such a young age. It's going to do irreparable damage to the queer community in New Orleans and across Louisiana. About 20 students at Ben Franklin High School produced a play based on their own experiences and performed it on the state capitol steps. Um, creating a new lens to try to get people to hear you, to understand you, to see you. This is not an angry protest piece. This is not a confrontation. This is an invitation to join us in a conversation about how and why these bills are hurtful. There's often many stereotypes and generalizations someone makes about us and who we are. Um, and I'm hoping if someone sees us, they will see us for our humanity. I'm, I'm always on the brink of just up and disappearing. The students hoped the play could spark some empathy, but only one lawmaker stopped to watch for more than a few seconds. <laughs> Lawmakers are expected to pass the bills in the coming months.